Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 5. Today we're going to be talking about some brand new exclusive news that you will hear nowhere else because we've officially found out some new information about some of the people that are going to be appearing in Episode 3. And also, I found out the Episode 3 title. We're going to be showing you guys all of this in today's video. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. And subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so what I have done is again, there was a leak of a script. So someone has taken a photo. It was actually the director of this episode. Just this time, this happened recently with Danielle posting an image of her script. And as you know, paper's not very thick. So you tend to be able to find out what is on the page below by changing exposure on Photoshop and that is what I did. So we've got a character list of what's going on. There's obviously a few names that I can't make out because, you know, it's kind of hard to actually see what's underneath and properly read it. But anyway, so at the top, going from top to bottom, we've got Kara zor slash Supergirl and on the other side there is text. And it says the actor's name, so obviously Melissa Benoist, but that's covered by the pen because they're trying to cover the episode title. I'll get to the episode title in a minute, but they have Alex Danvers next. Then we have James slash Jimmy Olsen slash Guardian, and it specifically says Guardian, so I'm guessing Guardian's going to be appearing in this episode, which is very exciting, or that he's going to still be Guardian this season because we haven't seen him as Guardian quite a lot recently. So yeah, looking forward to that. Then we have Jean slash Martian Manhunter, and then we have Lena Luthor, we have Brainiac 5, Nia Now slash Dreamer, Kelly Olsen, and there's actually some writing after Kelly Olsen's name, so I'm not sure what's going on there. I'm not sure if that's actually some writing coming up from the page below, because it is a different colour when you change the exposure, so... Yeah, I don't think she's gonna become a superhero or anything like that, so I think that's actually the page underneath. And then... The name underneath that, I can't actually read it, but you guys can figure that out. Okay, so the name under that is Andrea Rojas, the new character who's the new CEO of CatCo, who was revealed in the trailer recently, so that's exciting. She's on the series regular list, as well as the character underneath, William Day, the new reporter. So it seems like maybe he's going to be a series regular, but more than likely he's probably just going to be a recurring character. And then, so we sort of know all of those characters above. I still don't know who that one character is. It could be someone that we completely know, but whatever. We move down to the next name, and this is on the guest star list. So they have separate lists. You can see there is a gap. And this has revealed that Moran Jones is returning, that being played by Carl Lumley. So this is big news. We didn't know this was happening, and I am very excited to share this news with you guys. So Carl Lumley will be back. So Moran was actually obviously he returned last season, but he was a massive thing in season three. So he appeared in two episodes, I believe, last season, and he is obviously Jean's dad, but also Malafaic's dad, because Malafaic is the brother, the twin brother of Jean Jones. And I'm pretty sure David Tailwood is playing both him and his brother as well. So I'm not sure exactly on that right now. But anyway, so we move down and I can't actually tell what the next few ones are. But it seems like we have another member of the Jones family. I don't know who it is, but it has a slash next to their name. So it's obviously someone with an alter ego as well. So that's exciting. I am I reckon it's someone from, you know, their family or someone back you know, where they are from, because this episode seems to be, you know, it's going to be pretty heavily to do with Malafaic and Jean, because as you go down, and I still can't tell some of these names, we get young Jean in this episode, so he's on the character list, along with young Malafaic, which is super, super exciting, so this is a big thing, we have confirmed that there are going to be flashbacks to Mars, to when Jean and Malafaic were young, and so that's going to be happening in this episode, and this is obviously going to be a big episode to do with their origins, to do with, you know, how Malefic has been brought into the fold by the Monitor, and so this 
is going to be actually really quick into actually getting into Malefic and the stuff happening there and it's all going to wrap up by Crisis so that's super exciting to see all these different members of the Jones family actually coming in so it's going to be a lot of flashbacks in this episode but yeah so if we move down the one underneath that we've got a detective I don't actually know what detective it is don't get your hopes up it's not Maggie so it is a new detective it may seem or it could be someone we've seen before but I can't remember anyone else apart from Maggie off the top of my head really and then the list below I can't really tell you know who is who because it's all pretty much just exactly the same but the big revelation along with all of this is the title of the episode so changing the exposure I was able to find out that the title of episode 3 they are shooting episode 3 right now is Blurred Lines so this is seen on the screen right here we found out that it is Blurred Lines and so this is an interesting title obviously you get the reference Blurred Lines is essentially the lines between good and bad normally is referred to as a blurred line so I reckon this is to do with the origin of, you know, Malafaic and how he became who he is. He killed his own people, but he killed all the White Martians as well. So I reckon it's going to be them exploring how he became bad. And so just adding in as we head towards the end of this video, I've actually spotted another thing. There is, in fact, a character called Old Lady. And as far as I know, this is most likely in relation to the Old Lady that we had at the end of last season. So is this old lady to do with Leviathan? Is she back? I would say probably yeah if they're going with old lady. And also scrolling back up I think the character under Kelly Olsen is actually Eve Tessmarco because I totally forgot she was a series regular which is just stupid of me so sorry about that. But anyway so it seems like that old lady from the Leviathan teaser at the end of the season is going to return in this episode and so the story's going to continue. I have no idea if she's going to appear in the other episodes because, you know, with Eve being a series regular and the massive revelation all being to do with her and the fact that she's, you know, essentially being triple crossed. She's triple crossed. She's crossed Lex Luthor. She's crossed her friends and us, really. So, you know, she's going to be heavily involved with whatever is going to be happening with that specific storyline and the reason why I couldn't actually see that it was Eve Tessmarker she's actually written down on the script as Miss Tessmarker so I totally wasn't looking for an M I was like what's a series regular with M but now I see it it's Miss Tessmarker aka Eve Tessmarker I was not looking for that but yeah so that is just a correction I wanted to include in the video and so I reckon that Leviathan storyline is going to be playing in the background, sort of sizzling. And obviously the main focus, like I've said many times in this video, I do believe this is a origin sort of episode where we will get a lot of flashbacks to, you know, young Malafaic as we've confirmed. Also young Jean and Carl Lumley is coming back as Moran. So I'm guessing the old lady, if that is Leviathan old lady and Eve, aren't going to be such a big thing but just going to be sort of teasing what's to come in the upcoming episodes and with what they're doing on the flash right now i think what's going to happen is leviathan is going to be the villain in the back half that is going to be sort of continuing on after crisis so that's going to be dealing with the aftermath of crisis but also you know to do with leviathan and malefaic will be probably all sorted out by the time of crisis because you know the monitor brought him here with a purpose and that purpose will end with crisis so the purpose is to do with Jean and you know preparing him for what's to come so that is it for this video that is sort of my gist of what's going to be happening in episode 3 from the leaks that you have seen this whole video so I think there's a lot to look forward to I don't really know as to exactly what's happening with Malafaic apart from them exploring the origins and them sort of building to crisis and preparing Jean and the team for what's to come. So a lot of this is theorizing. So take what you see on the script, literally in this video as fact, but a lot of it is me sort of going around talking about my ideas. So let me know your ideas 
in the comments down below and are you excited for all of this because I sure am, I'm super excited, especially for this episode now that we know a bit about what's going to be happening. So thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys later, goodbye. I see red.